It was like a bomb going off. Boom, one loud sound, building came up, shook a couple times. On the morning of January 17th, 1994, a magnitude 6.7 earthquake ripped through Southern California. What came to be known as the Northridge earthquake killed dozens of people and caused billions of dollars in damage. Okay, we've got another aftershock coming. And new research shows something similar could happen here in Colorado. Earthquakes can strike very quickly. Mark Peterson is a research geophysicist at the U.S. Geological Survey in Golden. He's also lead author of a study that created these color-coded maps. These maps are made so that we can understand where future earthquakes will occur, how often and the sizes of different earthquakes, and the ground shaking that can occur from each of those events. The new seismic hazard model found nearly 500 new faults nationwide, six of them right here in Colorado. Many of the areas in green here show that there's a 5 to 25 percent chance of slight or greater shaking damage. Colorado is no stranger to earthquakes. In 1882, a magnitude 6.6 .6 earthquake rumbled the Denver area. This article in the Rocky Mountain News documented the sudden trembling. There wasn't much development at the time, so damage was limited. But imagine if the same sized earthquake, about the size of the Northridge quake, happened now. Could we have something similar to the Northridge earthquake here? I think so. I think that it's not as likely as it is in California, but we could have that kind of an earthquake. Peterson says the new model is not meant to scare people, but to simply make them aware that we are not immune to the Earth's shaking, and we need to make sure that even here in Colorado, we are prepared. And that we're taking precautions to be able to protect our families and loved ones in our homes. In Golden, Keely Chalmers, 9 News.